All right everyone. Like David said, we're going to find the four wanted police officers for causing a serious crime. We're going to split up into two groups to find all four of the wanted. Child abusers and corrupt officers. Are we clear with that? We agree with you Commander Lee. All right. Let's get inside of the building in two groups to find them. All right officers, good job on your work for the week. I'm giving you all free donuts as a way to contribute as police officers in the end city. To protect and serve. Enjoy. Tom, may we help you? Is this officers Tony and Simon? Um, yes we are. What do you need from us? Both of you. Hands behind your back. We what? We didn't do anything. Let us go right now. Absolutely not. You both are under arrest for allowing child abuse to Justine's parents. Officer Simon. I heard you gave a punishment day to Justine at the hotel. After Justine killed her parents there. She has the right to defend herself from her parents by the way they treated her from the past. You also blew up Justine's old house when she used to be an adult with a bomb in one punishment, and in the last punishment of that day, you called Satan to revive Justine's parents and made them red and very evil, evil parents. And made Justine sleep in a burnt and wore out mattress in her room there. Shame on you. To be honest with myself. Justin deserves to be punished for the way she acted and all the crimes she has done in the past. She deserved to have a punishment day at the hotel and have Satan revive her parents and make them red and evil, evil parents. For killing them at the hotel. And I allowed child abuse to Justin so she can be taught a lesson never to be a bad girl. Fuck Justin Scudder. And she deserves to be beaten up by her parents. Officer Simon. You do not talk like that about Justine Scudder. She is just a little girl. The Assassin's Task Force is right about you. As for you Officer Tony, instead of helping Justine, you send her back home. I understand she is a little girl who got aged from an adult. But you should realize that Justine is being child abused by her parents constantly, and I also heard you also called Justine's parents with Principal Kate to give her a bad punishment day. Um, Chief. I think this means we're fired right. That's right Officer Tony, you and Simon are fired from being police officers for corruption and allowing child abuse to Justine. You have abused your power as a police officer. And no donuts for you. Only good cops who don't allow child abuse can have them. ATF officers, send them away. And one more thing before you guys go. Officer Mike is in his office right down the hallway on your left. Tell him he is arrested and fired from his job as a police officer for allowing child abuse. And the two red and evil officers are in their cells because they got fired and lost their jobs as police officers for violating protocol. When they tried to stop Justine in a high-speed chase, Officer Mark was in charge of 911 phone calls we get we wanted to help her, but instead, Officer Mark told every police officer to go find her car and chase her down. Pure child abuse right? I agree. Thanks for telling me this information Chief Dallas. I will tell Officer David everything that Mike did. Right now. We have to send these two officers to the helicopter. Well do it is my honor to protect and serve, now abuse and be corrupt. Let me and Officer Tony go. Justin should be the one to be arrested. Not us. Or the good guys, Justin is a criminal. Alright Chief Dallas, can you come with me to Officer Mike's office? Thanks for telling us about Officer Mike. I am going to arrest him right now for all the tubals has caused. Sure do. Officer Mike. We got someone who wants to see you. And I know for a fact that it's not gonna be pretty for you to hear. Um, yes. May I help you? Hands Wait. behind your back. I didn't do anything. Officer Mike. You are under arrest for corruption, abuse of power and allowing child abuse to Justine Scudder. And for how you dealt with Justine when she tried to run away from her abusive parents and brought two red and evil officers in the operation. You are fired from being a police officer here in Vian City. And I never want to see you ever again. I already arrested the two red and evil officers you sent out. To capture Justine and send her back home to have a punishment day. Shame on you. And when Justine called you about the way her parents have been abusing her and Annabelle including beating her up over it not snowing and for the warm weather. 
and having her and Annabel sleep outside in a snowstorm all night in summer clothes. Instead of helping her out, you decided that it'd be a good idea to take the blame on Justine for all the stuff she has done in the past. She was badly being beaten up by evil Red Rage monsters aka her parents. And you allowed child abuse to Justine by refusing to arrest her parents by using Justine's actions in the past as an excuse. Shame on you. Actually, I don't really care. Justine has to be living this life for all the troubles she has caused. Including the time she blew up the McDonald's, the caramel ice cream place, and the Dakar with a bomb. I also called every police officer including two red and evil officers to chase Justine because she caused a massive car chase scene and should Shut up Mike. I don't even want to hear another word from you. The reason that chase happened was because of the way you handled her runaway situation. We could have helped her deal with her evil parents who child abused her instead. You had to be on her parents evil side. I had it with you. David, take him away. Will do. So Chief Dallas fired three of the corrupt officers. The two red and evil officers were already jailed by Chief Dallas. They are both serving life sentences each without parole in solitary confinement. After Officer Tony, Mike, and Simon were arrested by the ATF and being sent to Miami, Florida for court, Chief Dallas called all of the families of the three officers who were furious at their husbands for the loss of their jobs. You will see them at the Miami courthouse.